super quick, super easy way to de-warp 360 or 180 degree cameras using NX Witness. So I'm gonna grab my fisheye camera and pull it in here. Uh, you'll notice it's a perfectly round 360 camera in my office. Um, it's, a, it's a ceiling mount. So to start the de-warping process, you go to right click the camera settings, uh, say go down to the bottom here and say this is a fisheye lens camera, press OK. Uh, click on the fisheye tab. Uh, as, it, as you can see, it's a ceiling mount and it, it's already been chosen as ceiling mount. We can also do wall mount. We can also do floor table mount cameras. Um, then you're going to have to calibrate the actual fisheye lens. Fisheye lenses come with a lot of black uh, area around the uh, actual lens uh, captured video stream. So what we're going to do is we're going to crop out that that black area and, and we're going to get to the edges of the actual lens. Um, so here we go. In order to do this, uh, you can do two different ways. You can manually calibrate it so I can spend a lot of different time going up and down here trying to fit it exactly to where it's going to go, you know, side to side, all that good stuff. Or I can just press this little auto, ca auto calibration button here. The auto calibration button, boom, detects the edges. It's not going to be perfect every time, but it's pretty damn good. So when you're done, uh, go back here, press apply, and then OK. So you can see it's already in de-warp mode, so I'm going to disable that. Now I'm in un, I'm in regular viewing mode. If I go to the de-warp view now, I'm in a 90 degree view. Now I'm looking at something white. I'm not sure what it is, so I can just drag the camera around here. So treat it like a BDZ camera. I can drag it around and look around my office in a de completely de-warp view. And you can see I'm looking at myself, looking at myself, looking at myself. It's very meta. So I can go 90 degrees, I can go 180 degree view, which is not very flattering because it makes you look wider and I'm already wide enough. Or I can even go uh, a 360 view where you can see my entire office here, right? And I can kind of adjust the field of view to get it to be just right. But that's fish ID warping. The other thing you can do with fish ID warping is you can create zoom windows. So if you want to see like a, a, a ball seat that somebody sits on because they're trying to make their core stronger, and be not so wide then you can do that you can also drag around the zoom windows you could re you could draw as many zoom windows as you want on a fish, fish eye so you could really cover like a really large area with just a few different uh one 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 fish eye camera and a few different zoom windows pretty damn cool one of the coolest things about an x witness fish eye universal fish eye de-warping